It's that time of year again. We are back at Seven Springs Mountain Resort in Pennsylvania to hit the slopes for what's going to be another week of fun in this winter wonderland. Seven Springs Mountain Resort is only just a few hours drive from the DMV, nestled in the Laurel Highlands. Keep pushing, keep pushing. With plenty of options for beginners looking to learn the ropes on the slopes to the more adventurous. Seven Springs has you covered from rentals to the adrenaline rush. They even have you covered with the white stuff if Mother Nature can't provide it. Everybody thinks natural snow, oh, wow, we're getting six inches of natural snow, but you know, really I tell everybody, you step on it, how much do you have left? You know, you need substantial amounts of snow to, to actually build a base that we can actually ski on. Kirk Russell has been making snow here at Seven Springs for 40 years. He's got all the toys to make sure each slope is ready to go. Between 1,100 and 1,200 snowmaking guns, and those are permanently mounted across the mountain. Then we probably have between 40 and 50 portable guns that we take all over the mountain. We have the tools, now we just need the science. To make snow for all of us to enjoy, you need three things, air, water and cold temperatures and seven springs has it all the elves come out at night you know nighttime is the best time to do everything you get everything wiped clean while there's nobody out there you get a nice perfect finish then the first people out in the morning get to really enjoy it and you know what they say when the skiers are away the cats will play or something like that Check out the snow cats. They are used to push snow, groom the slopes, and build the terrain we ski on every day. The operator has to smooth the snow out with the, with the blade, level it out, and move the snow wherever you want it to. And then the tiller in the back actually grinds the snow up and it feathers it out and leaves a perfect finish then. It'll push the snow wherever you want it to. You know, you can lower the blade, you can push a blade of snow, and it'll level it out. And see how it just pulverizes the snow? They're just cool. I mean, it's something that nobody gets to do. And with that finish, is the job well done for Kirk and his team. And I'll walk up to the pump house in the morning and people high five, you know, you know, shaking your hand on the way up to the pump house, you know, they're happy. Kirk's been having over 40 years of fun, but it's your experience that keeps him going. Look at what you get to see every day. I get to run around on the slopes and check things out. You know, you get to see people having fun. It's really nice. I wonder if I'd be able to make the skiers and more importantly, Kirk proud. All right, Kirk, you're the expert in driving the cat, but can I take a whirl at it? I'm not an expert, but I'm sure you can do well in it. All right, let's see what happens. Let's go. Another year on the cat, Kirk, how'd I do? Good, you did great out there. <laughs> and you had fun. Oh my gosh, it's so much fun. The smile on your face was enough. Like a kid in a candy store. I can see why you have fun out there, absolutely. But I think I'm gonna leave it up to you guys, the professionals. Uh, maybe another year you'll be out there grooming the slopes with us. We'll see, you're a good teacher, thank you. Come back next year. Absolutely.